All right, today we're back with the Airbus A320. This time this is the Sobo version that comes with the game. So everybody on Xbox and PC has this plane. Everything here will work just the same on both systems. So we just came in from Chicago with a plane full of really over-optimistic people hoping to make a bunch of money in Vegas. In return, we're turning around and taking home a bunch of broken souls full of regret and remorse. Pick up the pieces of their shattered bank accounts. The easiest way to do that without backing out to the menu and using the map is to just put something into the uh, MCDU here. So hit the init button. You can see the from and to right here. So we're in Las Vegas. That is our from KLAS. Add in a slash here. We're going to Chicago. K O R D. I'm going to click the button up here. It's going to take a minute for this to load. Just let it go. Sometimes it takes a while. If you're not going too far, it happens quick. This is a pretty long distance, figuratively speaking. So now we've got this black screen here. It shows that it took our uh, uh, departure and destination that we hit return you just confirm that it's there if you want throw in a cruise altitude whatever you want to do we're keeping this super simple so we're going to click on flight plan you can see that it's there there's it it'll get you from las vegas to chicago here right now it'll do that but that's all it will do so we're going to click on destination and arrival and we're going to pick out a runway I know they're using 10 center today. So we'll click on that. Don't worry about any of that unless you know what you want. Click insert. And now you can see that it's added all of these points for us on the ILS arrival to 10 center. That's it right there. You're ready to go. If you want to double check, go up here and switch this to plan. Now it'll show all of the points that were added. You can cycle through these with the arrows. So you can see all of the points that are added. You can see what the route is from start to finish. Put it back to arc. All right. Uh, one other real quick point here. Some people have a problem with the not following the flight path, <laughs> flight path that we put in. If you have a heading here, click up on this button. So that you've got the three dashes, now it's going to follow the flight plan that we just entered. So let's wind this thing up and take off. Make sure to go real fast and jerky. The hungover people really enjoy that. strike there too. Put the gear up. If you're on PC and you can get the fly-by-wire, I highly recommend that. It's just miles ahead of the standard version of 320. All right, I'll click on the autopilot and it'll immediately start turning to follow our flight plan see right here it'll start coming around um, I got tail strikes and stutters and all kinds of stuff in here today give the people one last look at the city that broke them I don't think twice about coming back all right that's it it's really that simple wow stutters this is not a uh, proper way to do this. It's not 
any kind of correct procedure. It's just the easiest and fastest way to get something into the computer without backing out to the menu and creating a whole new plan. Hope it helped. Check it out and have fun.